What is going on, rockers? Welcome to Rocking with Robbie, the YouTube show dedicated to the newest rock and metal news, reviews, reactions, and all that good stuff. If that sounds interesting to you and you want to support this channel, make sure to give this video a like, hit that subscribe button and the notifications bell, and don't forget to leave a comment after you're done watching the video. Today I got a nice little double feature for you. First we're going to dive into some news on the newest Sleep Token album, and then we're going to actually review the track that they released to coincide with the announcement of their new album. I'm extremely excited to get into it guys, so let's go ahead and discuss some of these album details. Let's go over the album news real quick so we can get to the song review. So. Sleep Token just announced a 12-track album that is due out September 24th. The title is This Place Will Become Your Tomb. Like I said, it has 12 tracks, so let's go over the track listing so we can kind of get a feel for what this album might kind of be like. So the first song is Atlantic, then we have Hypnosis, then we have the song Mine, then we have the song Like That, then we have The Love You Want, Fall For Me, Alkaline, that's the song they just released by the way, uh, Distraction, Descending, Telomeres, I think that's how you pronounce that, High Water, and Missing Limbs. Wow, that last song sounds pretty interesting. So, Sleep Token kind of has a strange, abstract, atmospheric, kind of weird sound. I actually, somebody um, on the Wednesday show made me check out this band, and I've been kind of keeping up with them ever since, because I think they're really interesting. So uh, thank you to who that was. It's totally escaping my mind at the moment, but you deserve credit. So looking at the titles of these tracks, you can't really pick up too much from it, but if I'm thinking about the theme of Alkaline, which is a song I've already heard, and then just some of these other titles, I do think a title like The Love You Want kind of harkens to some kind of romance or some kind of relationship that went wrong or maybe isn't necessarily working the way they want it to. Maybe Hypnosis can be a song that's kind of about manipulating a person or something. Uh, but then you have a song like Missing Limbs, which seems really weird. So, you know, I don't really know what to make of it. They are a very strange, abstract band. They're going to do things how they want to do it. All I know is that I'm excited for the album, and I think you guys should all keep up with this band. So with that being said, let's go ahead and check out Alkaline. Sleep Token definitely hangs their hat on the amount of atmosphere and immersion they could put into a track. There's something about their songs that make you feel like you could really get lost in the ambience and the kind of the art of what they're doing, which is really cool. I think this song is a great example of that, and it's also a great example of them fusing their kind of abstract, otherworldly sound with a really strong hook that I think is more accessible to a broader audience. The vocalist definitely has a strange voice, but in the best way possible. It just sounds unlike any other singer, and I mean that as a compliment. The chorus has one of the catchiest hooks of the entire year. There's just something about it that'll get stuck in your head. It's extremely memorable, and it's really, really good. And it has a really strong, catchy hook that I think is accessible to a broader audience, but it still has this feeling of being very ambient, abstract, and generally strange in the best way possible. Lyrically, this song kind of depicts a woman with a strange element to her that the songwriter can't fully understand, so much so to the point to where he can't even really say if she's good or bad, but either way, she's kind of the object of his desire, and he's really getting a little bit obsessed with her. The general atmosphere on this track plays nicely into this theme. The song has this ambient backdrop that allows this sense of mystery to kind of overtake the listener, and there are these quick little riffs that kind of cut through the song that add a little bit more energy into the mix. It kind of adds this sense of urgency to the mystery, almost as if the person is so desperate to solve this mystery, but also might be getting a little lost in his own desires at the same time. 
It has an instrumental that kind of plays right into the theme, which I really like. Overall, I really enjoyed this song, guys. It has one of those choruses that really gets stuck in your head, but not in an annoying way. It has a really great sense of atmosphere, a great sense of theme, a theme that plays directly into the music, and vocals that are very strange, very abstract, but in the best way possible. I think all of these things kind of tie together to create a really unique song that I think a lot of you guys will actually really enjoy. I'm really excited for the new Sleep Token album. I'm definitely going to review it when it comes out. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the song. Definitely drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think of the song. Let me know if you like it, if you don't like it. If you want to support this channel, give the video a like, hit that subscribe button and the notifications bell. And until next time, guys, rock on!